The tournament's biggest names began their campaigns on day two. And first up, top seed Dominic Team, making his first appearance here in Washington and his first as number one seed at an ATP 500 event. The Austrian took on world number 96 on Laxman of Finland as he looked to translate his strong form on clay to the hard courts. If he can bring that more and more into his game, it's just not going to add another dimension to it. Although Team missed his chance for a double break, he nevertheless wrapped up the first set with ease. Right in the corner. It's a good return, he's being forced back. He's just still got really so well. much pace. His dominance continued in the second as Laxanen faltered. Oh, what a backhand that is. Look at the position he was in when he hit it. And although Laxanen managed to save his opponent's first match point, the world number seven's superiority showed. A straight sets win for team, and with it, a place in round three. It's long, and the top seed lives up to his billing in his first visit to Washington. Dominic team, efficient, clinical, and a straight sets winner in barely an hour. 2015 champion Kane Shikori was up next, this his first match of the tournament. His opponent, Donald Young, however, had come through a marathon match the round before. Although the pair traded early breaks, it was Nishikori who proved the stronger. Young perhaps feeling the effects of his previous evening's work. Oh, come on. Excellent backhands from Nishikori. It's a hat trick off them. The Japanese at number one was showing some deft touches as he wrapped up the set. Oh, what an improvised return that was. And able to finish the point off in fine style. But Young came back fighting in the second set. Nishikori had no response. It's been a bit of a spring in his step now, isn't it? With Young. Oh, what a time to bring that out. A tight third set in which Young managed to save three match points would be decided by a tiebreak. Bold hitting. It's Nishikori who nicks it as the second seed survives. Elsewhere, Juan Martin Del Potro wasted no time in beating Slovakia's Lukas Lako in straight sets. The three time champion safely through to the next round. Earlier in the day, home player Jack Sock and Romanian Maris Koppel also faced each other for the first time. In a closely fought opener, neither player could find a breakthrough. He's a bit of a showman, isn't he, Sock? With the scores tied at 5 all, the players were hitting their stride until Rain suspended play after just 47 minutes. The players faced a lengthy wait before eventually heading back out onto court. And when play got underway again, it was Sock who took the first set, making light work of his opponent in the tiebreak. Despite being separated by 71 places in the rankings, there was little to choose between the pair. Neither could create a great point opportunity. And there is the talent that he possesses. So set two was also decided by a tiebreak, and Sock was once again the victor, sealing his place in round three. It's wide, and Jack Sock has the win. And after an indifferent couple of months for him, that's all that really matters. Alex Zverev, Milos Raonic and defending champion Gael Monfils are among the big names to feature on Wednesday as the City Open gathers pace.